is the multiverse? Imagine if our entire universe, everything we can see, touch, and explore, is just one room in a massive house with countless other rooms. This is the basic idea behind the multiverse theory. The multiverse suggests that there are many different universes, not just ours, all existing at the same time. Alan Guth and Andre Lin during 1970s and 1980s developed theories about how the universe expanded very quickly after the Big Bang, which could create many bubble universes. The multiverse theory says our universe isn't special or alone. Instead, it's one of many universes that exist together. Each universe might have different rules, different physics, and different histories. Some might be very similar to ours, while others might be completely different. Scientists have come up with several different ways the multiverse might work. The quantum multiverse, in the quantum world, particles can be in multiple states at once until someone observes them. Instead of particles choosing one state, all possible states actually happen, but in different universes. This means there could be an incredibly huge number of universes out there. The inflationary multiverse, scientists think that right after the Big Bang, the universe expanded incredibly fast, faster than the speed of light. This is called inflation. This inflation doesn't happen the same way everywhere. In some places, inflation stops and creates a bubble universe like ours. In other places, inflation keeps going, creating more and more universes. The string theory landscape is a complex idea that tries to explain everything in the universe using tiny vibrating strings. This theory suggests there are many different ways these strings can vibrate, and each way creates a universe with different physical laws. The mathematical multiverse, what if every mathematical possibility actually exists as a real universe? This would mean that our universe is just one mathematical structure among infinite others. The multiverse theory explains by saying there are countless universes with different settings. Most of them can't support life, but some can. We naturally find ourselves in one that supports life because we couldn't exist in the others.